Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you're all doing well and staying safe. Now today I'm back with a different type of video. I'm coming on here to do a wig review of some wigs that I bought back in January. I found the wigs in my cupboard. They've been sitting there for months and I was like, I need to do this review. After that, I went online to look up the company. I couldn't find their website. It's unavailable, so it's clearly been shut down. And then I went on Trustpilot to look up some reviews on the company and when i tell you they are the worst hair reviews i've ever come across like there wasn't one good review like they were all completely trash and i was just like <laughs> and the funny thing is i i very rarely buy stuff online without looking at reviews of the company first but for some reason I just decided to buy wigs and the picture that they had up was of this short curly bob and it was so cute um, and it was advertised as you know a regular lace front and I was just like mm, you know what I'm gonna do it I'm I'm not hopeful like I said but here they are and I mean can I just say first things first any wig that is sent in this kind of bag and there's no box in there. I mean, that's a red flag straight away. Anyway, here goes. So I'm just gonna open them. And like I said, I ordered two. It was buy one, get one free. And in total, I paid, I think it was $62, which is about 51 or two pounds. I'm not hopeful that they're gonna be top quality. I wasn't thinking that they are gonna be top top quality. It's not like I'm expecting miracles here. I ordered a long curly one and a short curly bob. And this looks like the long one, I think. But yeah, so it's come with this. I guess this is supposed to hold the shape and it doesn't have any specs on it. No details whatsoever, it just says 1B, which is obviously the color. Oh, honey, straight off the bat. <laughs> oh my God. This is what they're trying to say, I guess, is a natural looking scalp. So it smells like um, packet hair. Like, yeah, it smells like. And you know what's hilarious? This is supposed to be like, I'm sure 18 or 20 inches. I mean, where, where? That this is the top of the wig and this is the end of it so where and honestly it feels like synthetic hair wow wow look at this please look at this shedding <laughs> i have barely touched the wig and it is shedding like crazy wow that is so trash <laughs> Okay, let me see what the inside is saying now. So, just got a regular, I guess, wefted. Just, it looks like dolly hair, honestly. It's got that horrible, like, synthetic sheen to it. This has to be the bob. Okay, I'm going to take it back. This has to be the bob because I can't see how this could be the long length one. So, I'm going to open the second one. Okay, yeah, my bad, my bad. This is the long one. I'm always jumping the gun and again with this terrible scalp i mean maybe i could put some um makeup on it let me try and put a little bit oh no baby this isn't working the knots are terrible. All right, you can see that's not really worked. I mean, I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest. I'm, I feel like a rookie now. I haven't done this for so long. No, that's, that's not working, honey. <laughs> that is not working. Maybe if I put some powder, I don't know. But this here, that looks like dolly hair. I mean, why? Like, I don't know if you can see that, but it is so matted. And the same thing, this shedding is crazy, crazy. I think it will be interesting to, to wash it and see, or not wash it with shampoo, but co-wash and see. I mean, 
can we take a moment for this shedding? <laughs> oh my God. No, seriously. What the hell is going on here? What the hell is going on? So inside, of course, you just have your straps. And I guess I should try it on. Oh my God. How are they gonna try and send me a wig and it's all nutty? Like, like I want locks. Did I ask for locks? I never asked for locks, you know. Jeez. Oh boy. Okay. Wish me luck. Oh my God. I mean, that is absolute trash, honey. Do you know, it feels so strange to have this on my head. I cannot tell you how strange it feels. Oh my God. I don't even like myself with short, um, with long hair anymore. That's how strange it feels. So like I said, this would never work in a million years having the top showing, but if you just wanted to throw a little hat on, it's kind of cute. And, you know, not go out, out. Like, if you just wanted to fling a little hat on and go to the shop, get some milk, get a loaf of bread, it could work. But, I mean... I mean... <laughs> What is this? Who thought this was okay? I'm so confused. I am so confused. You've got hair coming coming out of there. So they've put hair underneath where the scalp starts, which just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And even if you was to pluck this, it just doesn't make sense. It does not make any sense. But what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna co-wash it and see how it behaves. Um, because I, but nobody can tell me this is real hair. You cannot tell me this is not synthetic hair because it's not even like packet human hair. It's like, how dare you? How dare you? And the same thing with the bob, which it is a very long bob as well. But this definitely feels like a different texture. It's a lot shinier. Um, yeah. This, honestly, this feels like the long one feels like somebody has, like it's a returned item because all of this like at least with this one the curls are defined i mean you can clearly see a huge difference there i mean what the hell is going on so i decided with the long wig that i'm not even going to bother wasting my time and energy and condition i trying to revive it or do anything to it it's going straight in the trash where it belongs I did try and co-wash the shorter wig though, um, just because I wanted to see what it looked like and I felt like it had a little bit more promise. But as you can see here, the conditioner did not help me to detangle whatsoever. The shedding was just like mind blowing. I've never seen anything like this in my life, honestly. Even like this little piece of hair that I'm picking up here, it still had the sewn weft attached to it, which I'm just like, how, Sway? Like, how does this happen? So here is the wig freshly co-wash. Honestly, I don't know what the co-wash would do. I don't know what I was hoping for, if it would transform the wig and this scalp area, because honestly, the wig is just, it's unwearable. Even if this wasn't really bad, which I'm not sure how it's coming up on camera, but... Honestly, it looks like a Barbie doll scalp. Like, it is so bad. It is so bad. But even if that wasn't so bad, the fact that, like, this area has got this almost indefinite part, so you can see the weft and just this 
horrific oh boy I don't even know I don't even and here it's it's really thin and you can see like the weft like what is that why would they think that this is acceptable to send I did actually um get a card in the package which I didn't realize and it's got an email address on it so I did send an email to them obviously I'm not expecting to hear back but yeah because I thought why should anybody spend their hard-earned money to get scammed like this is a complete and utter scam like even if you go to the hair shop to the beauty supply store you can get some wigs that are so much better quality than this nonsense like dude this is synthetic hair like i just cannot I and it's like stiff and just the water hasn't even really penetrated it really well it's weird it's so strange it is so strange like it just it can't it can't be used i cannot use this i mean and as you can see there is not a scrap of lace like these people <laughs> sold me a lace front wig like where's the lace where is the lace like this is the kind of wig that people like men wear when they do comedy skits like this is the wig <laughs> like this is the wig in fact i might donate it i might donate it to a comedian because that is the only purpose that this should serve honestly you know what i'm not gonna give up i do want a really cute curly bob wig because i just love that look it's so cute and it's kind of like low maintenance and i will come back and show you that the moral of this story is don't buy wigs and hair or anything on instagram from a company who you're not familiar with <sighs> we can't be affording to be wasting our coins with scammers okay it is not worth it so anyway guys that's the end of the video thank you so much for watching remember if you're feeling my vibe comment like share and subscribe and i'll see you on my next one bye